Remove the map. Okay, there we go. There. The map has been removed. Okay, that was our first request. All right, so here we go. So here is the first level edit that we have made. We have removed the first part of the map. So here's what happens when you load up the level. <laughs> yeah, so here's our first change that we have done so far. You know what? People are saying to add and remove other stuff. But no one has suggested to add anything for Mario. Mario's just gonna keep falling. Okay, so I'll remove the death area here. Where's the death area? Okay, this death area has been removed. Is there also a death area here? Oh, there's another one. Okay, I'll remove both of those then. Okay, we want to add some boos. So boos are called Teresa. So I'll add a boo right here. Add 1-2. All right, so this is how our level is going to start. We're going to start right here. Add a question mark block with a cat suit in it. All right, Sky Heights. That is a great request. Add boost panels for the ground so you can't stay still. Okay, we'll add a we'll add a dash panel right under Mario. Wait, is Mario here? Okay, let's bring this closer actually, so Mario doesn't just fall. Let's bring that closer as well. Let's bring this up along this way. That should be a good spot. I want to bring this boo up so it's not just like out there doing nothing. Okay, and we also want to add a dash panel. Let's add a dash panel right to the start here. Right underneath Mario. Alright, so here's our level so far. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> okay, you've got a dash panel right at the beginning. Okay, the boo is there. We've got the world 1-2 map here, and we've got a block. A question mark block with a cat suit here. All right, so this is going this is going pretty well so far. Let's go back to the suggestions. Pipe? Okay, we could also add a pipe. A regular pipe or a pipe that launches you? Adding a big bird. I like that. Okay, we'll add a bird. Add an even bigger bird. Okay. Mario has to continue through the level. What is Mario going to walk on? What are we going to put here? Okay, we'll add a Goomba. We'll add a Goomba and a thick Goomba. So there's a regular Goomba over here. We'll put a thick Goomba over here Hold on how is how is this for a thick goomba how does that thickness look can we get a can we get a one in chat if that's a thick goomba right there it's a pretty thick looking goomba right there yeah that's a pretty thick looking goomba right there in chat look at all the ones in chat because that is a that is a thick goomba okay let's see what other suggestions did we have we'll put this pipe here let's put it down and the pipe has to be connected to something called a route token object. So we could add that like that. And there we go, and that is called parts. And by default, its speed will be zero unless someone changes it. Okay, so we've done quite a bit of changes. And we are going to test how this works because we've done a bit of changes here. Let's just make sure that everything is working before we start this up. Here we go. All right, let's see. So we start, we fall on the dash panel, we've got our giant birds here we've got a boo here we've got this pipe that makes you go very slowly we've got our oh, our magic koopa is a little low there we've got our thick goombas down here is our thick goomba oh no there's the other goomba this one should be a mega mushroom okay that's working fine uh let's leave that pipe for now oh my goodness i didn't realize that the dash panel would Oh, and the death area is removed because Jupa has the death barrier down here to be removed. So when you fall, you don't die. You just keep falling now. So Mario's just going to keep falling now. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, so I have to, have to actually reload the game. Okay, but let's see. Is there anything else to test? Okay, that pipe should work normally. This pipe should work normally. This is just a regular green star. Okay, let's go back to the lab and go back to the suggestions now all right let's see let's see let's see make the death barrier above mario that is a good idea let's see okay now let's bring it down okay so now the death area is now above mario i don't know if mario can go this high let's put it a bit lower so that maybe mario can accidentally jump into the death area add spike throwing a plessy if you add spike th oh wait no the game doesn't crash if spike throws a plessy so that's a good idea Okay, let's do this then. Let's add, let's, I really like the idea of a spike throwing a Plessy. But we need a platform for our spike throwing a Plessy. Okay, because we have to... This area is pretty full, so we're going to need some suggestions for floor. We could either make the floor like blocks or parts of levels like this as we move forward. 
Oh my goodness, make the trees floor. Oh my goodness. Let's see, if you put a tree sideways like this, would you be able to walk on it? I'm not sure. Okay, so here's what we're doing. We're going to make the trees floor. Okay, so let's add some trees here. I don't know if this will work. Uh, and let's see, what do we want him to throw? We want him to throw Plessy. So let's see, throw model is Radon. Add the ground back, but flipped 90 degrees. Cat Mario, step A. Okay, let's rotate it 90 degrees. Oh wait, wrong, wrong angle. Uh, I'm assuming that you mean rotate it around this axis. You know, this is kind of what I imagined this to look like. When you think of a, <laughs> when you think of a Twitch stream designing a level, is this what you have in mind? There we go, that's a nice long Goomba there. Okay, so there we go, we've got... <laughs> there we go, we've got our spike, throwing a Plessy there. We've got our boot, let's just make sure everything else is working. Okay, so the green star is working fine. This is working fine. Let's see if the floor works as intended. Oh wait, let's see if the death barrier works. That's a good question. Yeah, the death barrier is up there. If you go up there, then there is still the death barrier above Mario. That's really funny. Okay, so let's see if this is going to work as floor or not. Okay, you can stand on the trees. It's pretty monka s though. But yeah, okay, so these trees work as floor. Can I get up here? No. Ah, oh, the death- it's probably the death barrier. Oh yeah, and we've had a boom boom suggestion for a while. Okay, let's move this death area up a bit. Let's move it just above that Goomba there. So that we have a chance at getting through the level, kind of. Okay, guys, we need some more floor. Okay, world six? Okay, world six. What is in world six? Oh, do you mean like the world six map itself? Course select world six. Okay, so here we go. World six. Come on up, world six. World six is going to come along this way. Let's bring up world six. Okay, let me move this bird a bit out of the way so we could see a little bit. Uh, this bird is fine over here. Okay, do you guys want this toad to be here? Hey chat, do you want this toad here, or do you want to do something else to him, or get rid of him? Should we stretch him, get rid of him, or leave him? Chat is like, yes, yes, leave the toad! The toad must be there! Okay. <laughs> Big? What do you guys think? Make him thick? <laughs> let's see, let's make him face this way. Thick? Okay. Oh man, everyone's got a lot of- everyone wants a thick toad here. Hold on, why is he going like that? Uh, okay, how's that? <laughs> All right. Okay, and let's start going through some of the bosses that we want to add also. Okay, there's a big spiny. Okay, so I'll test this because I'm not sure if this toad guy will work or not. If he does, then we'll start adding some bosses too. And let's load up this new mod just to make sure that everything is working because when you're working on something like this you gotta check every couple of minutes just to make sure that everything is working fine. <laughs> Would a very tall conch door work? That's an amazing idea Komodo. I like the way you think. Let's Welcome VP. Hope you're doing well. All right, let's see what madness we have here. All right, we've got our spike throwing plessies. We've got some booze here. Head up onto these trees. Great, that hit us. Oh man, I've got to be careful because that might kill us. Um, okay, we can head on here. Oh, and both of them work! Okay, cool. So we've got this guy here. He works fine. Got our thick little toad over here. Got our thick toad here. <laughs> got our big spiny over here. Let's see. Beautiful course geometry here. All right, and then we're supposed to continue on to the right over here. Oh! Oh, no! Oh, I think I know why we can't go that way. Okay, let me show you guys why we can't go that way. Oh wait, maybe you could do a spin jump and dive over. But we'll probably have to add either a warp box or a pipe, just in case. So what would you guys rather have, a warp box or a pipe that goes across? Warp box would make it so you get a key first, that's a cool idea. Add a key piece in the wide toad, okay, in the wide toad. Hopefully we can get to it, it is now inside the toad. This toad is now destined to suffer because he is so wide and he also has a piece of a warp cube inside him. 
We have to sacrifice the toad to get the warp cube piece so we can continue along the level. All right, there you go. How's that looking, chat? How's that looking, chat? It's a pretty, pretty wide bird over there. All right, let's test this out now. Let's stop this. Oh my goodness. Just look at how wild this looks. There's so much going on before we even make these changes. Just look how wild this looks in the actual level. Oh yes, Tall Spike. We'll add Tall Spike. So let's just make sure that the Warp Cube is working as intended. Uh, let's get a power up first. What a beautiful level. I'm surprised that there wasn't a level like this in the... This is so weird. What the... Um... Okay, I'm on the tree. Apparently. <laughs> Toad, I need your Warp Cube coin. I need it so I can go into that Warp Cube. I'm sorry, but I must sacrifice you, Toad. Okay, our thick cat bird is fine here. And it flies away. Okay, so we want to add Boom Boom, yeah, because we want to add some bosses. Where should we put Boom Boom? At the beginning? Oh man, the beginning's so crowded. <laughs> okay, we'll add him to the beginning. There we go. At the beginning or after the warp box? Okay, chat. One in chat if you want Cat Boom Boom at the beginning. Two in chat if you want him after the warp box. Very important to vote right now. Yeah, let's add another green star here. We'll add a second green star. Omar's been asking for some green stars. Want to give Omar some green stars here. Here's a second green star. Let's see. Two, one, one, two, 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 one. Okay, it's 50-50, so I'll do both. So we'll have Boom Boom there. And after the warp box. There we go. Now everybody is happy. All right. Let's take a look at the level. Let's see how it's going. Oh my goodness, this is starting to really become something. Oh! Oh, I think we're seeing the cutscene for the Boom Boom spawning now. That's why. That's so funny. Alright. And we've got the Boom Boom music. Oh! Oh, and that now we spawned this Boom Boom at the beginning of the level. Okay, because we do have both Boom Booms. This is true. Oh, man. I don't want that Boom Boom to come here. <laughs> Leave me alone! Okay, he's dizzy. Okay, we'll leave him alone. We'll head on this way, because this is where we need to go. Alright, let's just head on over here. Oh, the green star's just there right away. Okay, that's fine. I'll just take the green star. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness, that's a conch door! I'm like, what is that that's running towards us right now? Okay, so let's take that. Let's get rid of that. Let's take this. Okay, nice. Now we can head in here. All right. Oh. Okay, I thought we'd be soft locked. We are not soft locked. Okay, it's a bit hard to see what's going on. Oh no, but we can continue. We can continue. We are good. Okay, and we can make it all the way here. Can we make it there? Maybe if we climb up onto this pipe. Okay, and. Okay, we made it into the Toad House. All right, this level is going pretty great so far. And we're able to make it to here. Okay, so, oh my goodness, all the enemies are just falling. All right, there we go. Okay, we're getting pretty good. I really like where this is going. Alternating spike floor. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, Super wants to turn this into a Kaizo mod. All right, let's see. Here is our level. Here's our amazing level. All right, spinning. Oh no, I accidentally went into the dash panel and I'm triggering a second boom boom to appear. Now, where am I even? Okay, I'm not dead. What happens if I go into the pipe? This pipe doesn't bring you anywhere, so you just pop back out. Okay, I defeated the boom boom, nice. I'll take this. Boom boom, stay away. Boom boom. Okay, let's just hop along here. And there's no death barrier down there, so if you fall, you just keep falling forever. Ah, <laughs> oh, man. Okay, let's reload this. I, I need to make sure that everything in the level is working fine. No! That plessy counts as a spike bar. Okay, I'm, I want to stay away from that conch door. Man, those conch doors are fast. 
I need to get into the warp box. Okay, there we go. Okay. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, I thought that that star thing, I thought that was a cat bell power-up for some reason. I don't know why. I know that I didn't put a cat bell power-up there. Okay. Let's just head up here. Face this way, please, Mario. To the right. Nice. Okay. Oh, we made it in. We made it in. We made it in. Okay, so that warp cube is a troll. But where you want to go is in here. Okay, head down here, get the boomerang power up. Okay, take damage, that's fine. Get the next power up. Uh, oh! Can you... Oh, you can't stand on those. Okay, at least we died, that's good. Okay, now chat, we need to add some things here. What are we going to want to see here? Let's take a look at... Our suggestions. We died, so that's good. Yeah, exactly. Prince Bully. Prince Bully's always a good choice. One of my favorites. This is an amazing level. Guys, chat, you guys are amazing for coming up with these ideas. This is coming out so well. Alright, head in there. Down here, get the power up. Oh, and Prince Bully's down here. Very nice. <laughs> Look at the spikes being thrown. <laughs> <laughs> These are the spikes that are being thrown. Oh my goodness. And he's throwing them so quickly. He is creating an army of spikes. This is amazing. This is so good. This is one of my favorite parts. This spike throwing all the spikes. That's so funny. Okay. Oh, and the hammer bro's up here. Okay, he fell off the platform. That's fine. Let's see. All right. You can make it so there is something that you have to get up here so that there is some cool jumping. Okay, and Lessian, can we continue to the next part of the level? Yeah, and then we can continue to the next part of the level. You know what? I honestly think this second part of the level fits pretty well. Like, the transition to Super Bell Hill here is pretty good, I think. Okay, chat, here's a, here's a big question. Here's a big question. This is an important question. Do we remove this? Do we remove it and replace it? Or do we just build around it? Slightly tilt it? <laughs> okay, slightly tilt it, there we go. And hold on, let's slightly tilt it that way too. Slightly tilt it on every axis. There we go. Hold on, where's the goal pole now? Oh my goodness, the goal pole's like just, goal pole's like buried now. Okay, where do we want the Great Tower of Bowserland to be? How's that? What do you think of this chat? Add the title screen level. That's another really good one. There we go. Ah, this this is a creative idea. I like that you guys, you guys are looking out for me. You want to add, like, everything into this level. Like, all possibilities. Like, this is something that we don't have yet, so it's good. It's good. We gotta have, gotta have unique stuff in the level, you know? You can't just do all one thing in the level. You want to have unique stuff in the level. It's a, it's a nice touch, I think. A trampoline! Yes! Yes, yes, yes. We need trampolines. We don't have trampolines, so we need trampolines. I can't see anything. I think it's because we're inside the tower. Let me out of the tower. Yeah, if you set a trampoline to a jump height of zero, it's pretty funny what happens if you go onto it. I don't know if it soft locks you, but... <laughs> Makes a pretty funny sound. There we go. For our dear friend Bobby. Put shoutouts to simple flips in it, yeah. <laughs> 69. 69 is pretty high. I think that's a good one. Make the flagpole only accessible with a certain character. Oh man, oh man, that's that's really something. You know what? That's actually such a good idea though. <laughs> I love this row of spikes that are being thrown. So funny to me. Okay, we've got our fake goal pole here. Our high trampoline with a height of 69. Player flower suggested by Anime Girl. Jump platforms. Ah, these are so cool. This was such a cool addition. The, the jump platforms here that are by the Tower of Bowserland. Ah, it just looks so good here. Just looks so good here, IMO. Okay, let's head down here. Okay, got a green star here. What if we head down here? How weird is this going to be? Pretty weird. 
pretty darn weird. Okay, all water and stuff. That's how spikes reproduce. That's so funny. Oh, we've got a wide Koopa guy here. Oh, this cat Goomba's having a bit of trouble here. Hammer Bro's also having some trouble throwing hammers at Mario right now. We've got this sunken ship in the background. Oh, can I not leave? <gasps> no. I'd like to... Let me out! We might have to add, like, a warp cube or something here. I was laughing that the cat Goomba was stuck, but it looks like we are also stuck. Ah, <gasps> oh, almost made it. Okay, we might have to add a warp cube or a pipe there. What would you guys rather have? Okay, so chat, do we want a pipe to go through here, or how are we going to get through from here to here? Oh, because this is the Tower of Bowser Land. A door. Okay, you know what? That's another great idea. I didn't think of that. That's actually a really good idea. We definitely want doors. We want... Lots of uniques. It's so funny that we're adding a door on the Tower of Bowser Land. Have this sign pointing right at the toad. So you know to look at the toad. That is very important to look at the toad. I can't go through the door! No, so I can't even test what happens next. Okay, so I've got to I've got to adjust this door so that we can actually get into the door. Okay, the door works now. <laughs> that frames bully though. <laughs> it's pretty good. Pretty good. Oh, what is that? Oh, large bob -omb. Very flat bob -omb. Oh my goodness, guys, look, it's a it's a CD, it's a record. This record is really the bomb, literally. Tall Tuck Condor. How tall? Chat, is this tall enough or should we go taller? How tall do you want the Tuck Condor to be? What do you guys think? Taller? Okay. We'll make it even taller. Alright, how's that? Chat, is that good or taller? Okay, taller, taller. Oh my goodness, everyone's like, taller, taller, make it taller. There you go. Okay, you'll only be able to see its feet now. That's how tall it will be. <laughs> Such a cool camera angle. Okay, we've got the Goomba mask here. <laughs> Look at the little pipe there. Oh, I thought that maybe those guys wouldn't chase you if you have a Goomba mask, but I guess it only works for Goombas. What the? This is the conk door. That line that's sticking out of the ground. This is the conk door right here. I lost my Goomba mask to it. That spider-looking thing, that is the conk door, those lines, that is the conk door. You guys wanted this. This is because of you guys. <laughs> okay, we've got Bowser's car. Car's looking pretty wrecked right now. Oh, okay. You know what? I actually did something weird. I replaced wooden crates with uh, Womp's Fortress. From Super Mario 64. Um, so while it's not a wooden crate, I could keep Womp's Fortress from Super Mario 64 textured as a wooden crate if you want that. Chad is like, keep it, keep it! Okay. <laughs> Perfect. Even better than what I asked for. Okay, how is this looking? Is this looking like a 5? Chat, is this looking like a 5 to you? Is this what a 5 looks like? Does that look like a 5? I think that's okay for a 5. Should I delete that one or keep that? I think I should keep that. It looks weird without it. How's that looking? Looks like a 5? Okay, nice. Now we need a 0. And now, all we need is the K. Wow, this is going much better than I thought it would. The letters are actually looking like what they're supposed to look like. Oh, uh, I think K is actually going to be the hardest letter. I didn't think this one would be the hardest, but I think it might be. Oh, that looks so weird. How do I make a K? How do I make a K? What do K's look like? Can someone in chat post the letter K just so I know what a letter K looks like? I don't know what the letter K looks like. I'd like to see a letter K as a guide. That looks so weird! <laughs> no, actually, that kind of looks okay. I think that's- I honestly think that's the best I could get. Sock. <laughs> sock. Congratulations on Sock, ZX Many. We have achieved Sock. 
Wow. Sock has been achieved. Okay, let's just head on down here. Through the door, that's working fine. Okay, there goes Prince Bully. Okay, here's a... Okay, here are the tanks. And they're not moving, they're just going to be stationary like this. Okay, here's a trampoline with negative speed. I think we might soft block. Yeah, you can't move, so that's what happens when you go out to a trampoline with zero speed. <laughs> yeah, so you're actually stuck here. You can't exit course or anything. The trampoline is just starting to glow now. Oh yeah, and here are the pipes. Wait, where are the pipes? Okay, so the first pipe will be super fast. Okay, so this is the pipe with a speed of negative 69. As you can see, Mario just goes slowly through the pipe. It's just like he has a speed of zero, and he's going to die when he goes through. So I'll reload, and I'll check the last pipe just to make sure everything's going okay. Alright, and this pipe should just launch us out really quickly. Let's see. Yeah. <laughs> so that happens. Oh, we see the little Goomba flying down there. Negative speed dash panel. I can't believe we haven't... I can't believe we haven't added a negative speed dash panel. We can put the negative speed dash panel next to the negative speed trampoline. Oh wait, no, but oh, the thing with the dash panels is dash panel speed isn't actually adjusted in the object itself, but you have to edit the character. So you can't have both a- well, in using this method, you can't have both a positive and a negative dash panel speed in the same level. It's, it's dependent on the character. Alright, Super SOK Hill. Mario lands on a dash panel, then suddenly you see Boom Boom over here. You see, uh, Spike throwing some plessies over there. Just waiting for the dash panel to run out right now. Oh! And it looks like a second Boom Boom has been triggered. Got some wide Goombas and Magic Koopas down there. Let's get this green star here. What's in there? Oh my goodness, it is a Mega Mushroom! Wow! I like that it doesn't defeat him right away. It just damages him. Can we get him again? Okay, we got a second hit on him. Not bad. It's like he can't damage us when we are like this. Uh-oh. He's spinning. He's spinning. Okay, we got him. He has been defeated. No, he hasn't been defeated. How many times did I hit him? Okay, if you go into this pipe, it just returns you back. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I want to get that question mark box. Okay. There's normally supposed to be a cat bell in here, but since I'm little, it'll just be a mushroom. Let's head on this way. Just walk across these trees. I love that someone suggested make the floor trees. <laughs> Such a good suggestion. Okay, let's just climb up the tree here and then hop on over to those clouds over there. Get this green star from Captain Toad right there. Oh, and look at this sign. Look at this toad right here. Gotta get that. Got a very tall conch door over here. And a very large spiny. Gotta get that key piece. Oh. Oh, and there's some large birds in the background. I don't know if I pointed them out. There we go. Got the key piece. Now we're ready to go into the warp cube. Go into the warp cube. Head into the pipe right away. And... Ah! Uh, looks like Boom Boom was spawn camping us. Okay, camera's a bit weird right now, but that's okay. We made it through. There we go. Making it through the level. Uh, let's just head on to the right over here. Up there. Because, you know, there's a pipe there. Why would you go in the pipe when you could go up and around the pipe? If you go in here, you might think, oh, you have to get that key piece and head into this warp cube. But you just pop out here. Oh, and you do die. Okay, so there is a death barrier there. If you fall near the beginning of the level, there's no death barrier, so you don't die. Get the green star. There you go. Just got a tall spike chilling there. Get on in here. Get the boomerang power up. What? Why can I not go? What's, what's happening? This didn't happen before. Why can I not go? What is stopping me from going that way? We didn't add anything there, did we? What's going on? Why can we not continue? What happened? What happened? We didn't even add anything there. What happened? <laughs> boom Boom just flies off the level. <laughs> oh my goodness, you could defeat Booze? I didn't know that. 
Okay, I was so worried that I would fall off the level. Wait, what the? Where did that Goomba come from? What the? <laughs> How did the Goomba get into that pipe? I didn't know that you could go into that pipe. <laughs> All of a sudden, there's a Goomba that went into the pipe and just fell into space. What's going on? Now, let's see. This pipe should be able to take us through without any problems. Yeah, it looks like we won't have any weird collision collision moving forward, I hope. Whoa! Whoa, 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 What in the world is going on? What in the world was that? What in the world was that? This honestly looks so cool, this right here. <laughs> I love this. You've got some tanks here, green star here, large Octumba. You don't want to step onto that trampoline because it's got negative height, you soft block. Got a giant green star right here. You get it, it counts as several green stars. You could pick up a CD over there. Oh, I forgot, you have to play as Toad. Because you can't step on that switch with Mario. Oh yeah, that's the conk door. The giant coin here. Oh, we can't reach it. Got a Goomba right over here. Little Goomba pancake. Got an SOK here. Congratulations on Sock. We got some nice birds over there. I love how the Prince Bully just runs through the tower. It looks so funny to me. Also, these overlapping levels look great. Oh, I was hoping I'd be able to hold it. Okay, but now we can get that switch. That appears. And there we go. We finish off the level. What a great level. Chat, thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for all the suggestions. This was such a fun experience, and I hope to do this again in the future. I think this could be a great live stream again if we do this again. This is such great content. It's so fun to do. <laughs> oh, man. All right, yeah, I think another time in the future we could do 1-2 again. It'd be it'd be really fun. Those of you watching on YouTube, you're welcome to check out my other videos if you'd be interested in seeing more of what is possible in games through both regular gameplay and hacking. I've made a few custom levels of Super Mario 3D World and Bowser's Fury, playing the maps as levels, testing what happens if you add items and enemies to the maps, all kinds of experiments in these games that you might enjoy. Wishing all of you a fantastic day, and take care, everybody.